नमस्कार इंडिया मेटोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वेलकम यू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट थ्री फोर डेज द रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ओवर मध्य प्रदेश स्पेशली सदर्न पार्ट्स ऑफ मध्य प्रदेश गुजरात एंड नदर्न पार्ट्स ऑफ महाराष्ट्र इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी इंटेंस एंड हैवी टू वेरी हैवी विद एक्सट्रीमली हैवी फॉल्स आर लाइकली ओवर दीज एरियाज ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट थ्री टू फोर डेज सो वी विल लुक इनटू दिस इन डिटेल एंड बिफोर दैट अंडर द इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ द वेलमार्क लो प्रेशर एरिया ओवर नॉर्थ छत्तीसगढ़ एंड नेबरहुड extremely heavy rainfall has been observed over balaghat and sivni districts of east madhya pradesh and very heavy rainfall 16 cm rain, rainfall has been observed over champa district of chatisgarh and also uh, vidarbha has reported uh, very heavy rainfall of 12 cm so active to vigorous monsoon conditions are likely to continue over central uh, west and north peninsular india during next 3 to 4 days and uh, this this is going to happen under the influence of the wellmark low pressure area which is currently over northeast mp and neighborhood and the monsoon trough is extending from southwest rajasthan to the northeast bay of bengal and it is extending up to the lower tropospheric levels and also there is a trough from south konkan to the cyclonic circulation associated with this wellmark low pressure area over northeast mp and this uh, trough is in the middle and upper tropospheric levels so uh, uh, the the Uh, monsoon trough is uh, quite to the south of its normal position and uh, that which which uh, uh, obviously corresponds to active to vigorous monsoon conditions over central and west india so that uh, those those types of conditions we can uh, we can uh, uh, see uh, uh, at present so uh, if we look into the warning map for day 1 then uh, over uh, Uh, east mp isolated extremely heavy falls are likely today and uh, uh, then as this system moves uh, westward so the rainfall intensity over east mp would decrease to isolated very heavy rainfall from tomorrow and then it would uh, 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 from 18th of september the east mp would become free from rainfall warning area and uh, and uh, Uh, also west mp isolated extremely heavy falls with light to moderate uh, falls at uh, 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 at most places and moderate to heavy falls at uh, some places is likely during next 24 hours and uh, over uh, extremely heavy falls over west mp would continue uh, till 17th of september uh, as this system which is currently over northeast uh, mp uh, uh, or at the central parts of east madhya pradesh would move west very slowly towards uh, west mp during next 2 uh, to 3 days and thereafter it would be located over uh, uh, gujarat uh, northern parts of gujarat and adjoining southeast rajasthan on 18th of september so that's why the rainfall belt over uh, over west mp and gujarat is going to uh, is going to uh, remain steady for next 2 uh, to 3 days so uh, on west mp the rainfall intensity would uh, reduce from 18th of september when there would be no uh, uh, weather warning over the region and and uh, Uh, extremely heavy falls over gujarat are likely to begin from 16th of september that is from tomorrow and it would continue on 17th as well and on 18th of september over over gujarat region the rainfall activity the rainfall intensity would decrease to very heavy rainfall and and also saurashtra and kutch is likely to receive uh, uh, heavy rainfall on 17th 18th and 19th of september but on 18th of september the saurashtra and kutch uh, would be uh, uh, receiving heavy to very heavy rainfall and along with this uh, uh, northern parts of maharashtra and konkan and goa is also likely to receive isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall during next uh, next 3 uh, days uh, in which uh, the madhya maharashtra especially northern parts of maharashtra nasik aurangabad and uh, uh, this uh, 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 northern parts of madhya maharashtra area would uh, is is likely to receive extremely heavy falls on tomorrow that is 16th of september and thereafter it would decrease to heavy to very heavy rainfall 
and now this is the scenario for uh, central and west india by by 19th of september this uh, system would be over uh, southwest rajasthan and adjoining saurashtra uh, adjoining kutch area and uh, so on 19th of september this system would be causing isolated heavy rainfall only only over saurashtra and then it would uh, the system would emerge into the northeast arabian sea and there uh, after emerging into the northeast arabian sea it may intensify further and then uh, one more system is coming that is from 17th of september we can see a cyclonic circulation over north and one sea in middle tropospheric level which which would descend in the lower tropospheric levels on uh, uh, by 18th and 19th uh, 19th of september and under the influence of this uh, heavy rainfall activity is likely to begin over odisha from 18th of september as we can see isolated heavy rainfall with light to moderate rainfall at many to most places is likely over odisha on 18th of september and on 19th of september odisha and chatisgarh are likely to receive light to moderate rainfall at most places with the uh, moderate to heavy rainfall at isolated places so that's all for today tomorrow we'll again meet with delhi weather briefing for weather warning during next five days thank you and goodbye